Hey guys, Sponge Murphy here. So, uh, Crypt Towers, yeah, nearly done. Nearly have them all finished completely. Um, the only thing I'm wanting to do is just get decent bases on them. And they're pretty much finished then, so I'll just go over this guy that I had done. Um, I can't remember the last video if I did show that I got all the bone colour done. But um, if I turn it that way. Oh, there's a bit of glare. Um, yeah, it's a bit. I would like a bit more tone in the bone colour, but you know, it's nice. It's clean. It's like it's not too dirty looking. Um, I had the red done on the in the back of his just under the spine. I don't know what that part you'd call it. His back anyway. I have the spine coming up. Um, I left that like it's not like bloody. It's not like a new wound. So I don't want to put it on messy all over it, like with all blood. And then I got the brown kind of fur parts on it. So they were just pretty simple too, just the just, um, best colour I washed and just highlight it. Yeah, so and then I got this guy finished. Just if I get him in. Okay, sorry about that, I just had to clean the lens, there was a bit of a smudge on it. So, if I lower this down a bit. I got this guy finished last night. Um, every all the colors are the exact same as the other guy, um, but this guy has a lot more bone on him. There's like parts sticking out of his back, and he has like the big club as well. So with the, you can hear the ice cream man. But so with the skull here, instead of just doing it, it's like another bone color. I went through it to keep it like it's a fresh kind of skull. There's all blood still all over it. And the same there for the skulls on the back. So you kind of focus in. So I'm, um, yeah, and then he has the corpse up on here as well. Which I went with kind of like a rotten kind of colour on him. And then just like the blood on the bottom and the open wounds to make it look a little bit fresh as well. And then just sticking out the top of the bone as well. So, um, yeah, I really enjoyed doing these models. I really wouldn't mind doing another like two or three of them, like converting them up or something for something different would be pretty cool Um, yeah he has a big bone club with spikes on it so they kind of come out pretty decent as well, I like the colours on them Um, there's something about this guy's went to say a little bit, I can't remember yeah I think, no actually, I think he was just talking about the bass I wanted to guess, I was thinking of like putting um. The coffin lids on the base, so if we're going to try and get some, uh, maybe balsa wood would probably be the best for doing that. Um, and then just try and just like put like normal gravel and then grass all around that, so I kind of keep it as if he's in a graveyard or a crypt because I have to do the Vargas um, base as well, so all of them are kind of going to be similar and going to do them all at the same time. So, um, let me know what you guys think. I think this guy came out. I like this guy, I think the thing on his back, like the body on the back is pretty cool. Um, leave a comment below, hit the like button and uh, looking forward to know what you guys think of him. Um, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe and I'll catch you guys next video, thanks for watching.